Hello folks and welcome here once again to Divine Fine Motors and thank you so very much for being here. God bless you and your family and I mean that with all of my heart. I hope and pray that you're well, healthy and happy wherever you may be at this moment. And boy folks, if you've been looking for a Jeep and hoping and praying and believing, that's what makes it work. This is one you ought to put on your short list or just pick up the phone and give me or my lovely bride, bride Reba a call just as soon as you can because I'm pretty sure this little jewel will not be around very long. Again, thank you so much for being here. Usually I do this in my driveway at my house, but I've been feeling under the weather here a little bit. And I just uh, thought I'd go ahead and do a little video for you here at the shop. This is our shop, by the way. You can see some of my Corvettes under the cover there. Uh, one of my, looks like an antique boat and a motorcycle and a few other things. But this is where we do a lot of our divine finds and get them ready for the next fortunate customer. Uh, I think I might have mentioned... My wife and I, we started buying these Jeeps probably about three or four years ago. We're both from West Virginia. We've always had a love for Jeeps, but they have just been so expensive that we just never got around to buying them, but start buying them and man, we sell every one we get. Of course, we go out and get the really, really, really nice ones. If they aren't nice, I don't mess with getting them. But I tell you what, folks, this one right here You'll just absolutely love it. It is the, has the world famous 4.0 inline six cylinder. They are just an amazing motor. I think about everybody knows that by now. You know, they stopped making that in 2006 and in 2007 put a 3.8 in them, I believe until up to 2012. Then they went back down to a 3.6. But anyway, folks, this thing's got the six cylinder. It's got a five speed manual. It's four by four. It's got the leather steering wheel, the tilt, the cruise. It's just amazing. It's got a super, super nice JVC stereo system in it with the CD and Bluetooth and MP3. Some really nice speakers, speaker covers. And man, it's got some super nice stuff on it. Not too much, but just enough to make it stand out in a crowd. It's got some really nice, almost like brand spanking new tires and uh, really nice ultra uh, wheels on it. They're 18 inch. I believe they're 285s. And uh, you can see, and they've got all five of them. The nice fender flares you got the running boards on this thing the wheel and tire package it's lifted a little bit nice shocks underneath it i love 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 this window frame or whatever they call it super nice led lights that work all the way around it it's got some nice hinges on it the factory paint is just absolutely amazing on it and they did a remarkable job with the paint uh, when they had this painted. That's all metal, folks. That's a heavy duty and amazing thing. And if you don't like that, all you got to do is it unbolts. These three bolts hold it on, the other three on the other side. It's real easy to take off. But underneath that, all the factory cowl and all that stuff looks fantastic. You can see how nice it is by looking at the windshield wipers. Windshield wipers will tell you a lot about a car. It's got, looks like to me, a brand spanking new best top top on it. It's got some seat covers and I'll show you, but it's got the original, this is a 2000 model. It's got the original Jeep seat underneath those covers, of course, that look fantastic. But I kind of like the yellow and black covers, but I'd probably take them off. I'm kind of a purist. Again, super, super nice wheel and tire package. You've got custom bumpers on the front and the rear. You've got tow hooks, again, the LED lights. You've got a super nice uh, Smitty built, built 
winch, RC winch, light bar, the winch even has a cover over it. All that stuff is just clean as can be underneath there. You can see your winch, how nice and clean it is. Underneath this Jeep, folks, is as nice as the rest of it. Looks like some newer parts have been added. All the springs, you can see you're in great condition. No signs of rust or corrosion or any of that nonsense. It's really a great, great Jeep. You can see how nice it runs down the road, how even those tires are wearing. Ice cold air. It's got some brand spanking new, big uh, rugged uh, ridge line floor mats in it. Original carpet still in it. All the original interior as far as the dash and the console and all that stuff. The leather steering wheel looks amazing. It only has 135,000 and that's nothing for one of these Jeeps. You can see all of the jams, all the hinges. It all is just in really great condition. The back seats are the same way. Let me show you, I think I've got this pulled loose here. But yeah, that's that whole seat right there. I mean, no rips or tears in that thing that I saw anywhere. But it is nice, and I'd say that back seat probably never been set in. Again, you can see how nice this frame is. Uh, I just love these Jeeps. I was going to take that one to Mecham, and I had a customer been trying to buy something off of me for six months. I've sold that other yellow one. I've got a super nice 97 white with tan coming up for sale pretty soon. But this one right here, whoever's going to be blessed to get this is just going to love it. In the back, this looks the same as the front. Everything looks super nice. Springs, shocks. Again, a nice custom bumper. Let's see what size these are. 275, 65R18s. There you go, brand new spare tire. Now this was wired up with the mount to take this tire off. I'm gonna make sure we send you that mount. I like them a lot better with the tires on them. If you don't, you're more than welcome to take it right back off and uh, do it however you want. But as you can see, no rust whatsoever back here, just as clean as a pin. Uh, even got some wires wired up back here if you'd like to hook up an amp or a subwoofer. You can see again all of your hinges and everything. Well, look at that. That's the factory paint, folks, on the back of this tailgate. Boy, you hardly ever see that in the back of the Jeep. But uh, there you go. Just a really, really nice, nice vehicle. I'm about done. I'm about wore myself out already. Uh, I'm gonna start it up for you. It runs and drives and rides folks down the road like it was new. <laughs> I mean, it really does. It handles great. It starts up fantastic. Uh, I should have turned the lights on for you. Four wheel drive works great. Air conditioning's ice cold. Of course, you can't feel that there, but it works great. But yeah, look at this steering wheel. That's the original leather steering wheel. Like I said, it's got the tilt, it's got the cruise. All your lights work, signal lights work, tail lights work. Look at that. I mean, this is an awesome, awesome Jeep. I think there's even an XM. It looks like an XM antenna there. So it must have XM radio as well. No lights. That's a high beam light there. Probably turn that off. And it's got a, a fuel light. My detailer loves when the fuel lights are on on my vehicles. Bless his heart. But man, he's an awful good worker. He's one of my best. Got some nice handles. Again, I love this little thing here. I've never seen one in a Jeep, but there it is. All 
all the sun visors are great stereo works great if you can get a station I'm inside this garage right now let me turn these things off oh turn those off there she is folks you got two numbers on there what I do I give everybody a chance to go ahead and buy it now at the reserve price I'll do the same for you that is before it has been met when it's once it's met and there's less than 12 hours to go I have to go ahead and sell it to the highest bidder but that's always works out great for me <laughs> and uh, so uh, we can also help you get it shipped anywhere in the country uh, oh. and uh, we can help you get it shipped my wife Carol will get your sales packet out to you immediately once we take your deposit and uh, you're going to have something real real special oh I didn't even show you the motor let me I took some pictures of this motor but let me show you this right here and I know it's just a Jeep and you're probably not going to be able to, probably not wanting it to take the car shows but if you did you could and you would probably leave there with a trophy again it is absolutely immaculate inside outside everywhere you can look it's just an awesome awesome I think, boy, and these are getting harder and harder to find people in this kind of condition. These Jeeps are getting more and more desirable and harder to harder to find. Isn't that usually how it happens? But there it is. And I think I got underneath everything and showed you, but there's all of that under there. Skid plates, you can see how nice all of that is. So thank you again. God bless you. I got to say thank you to all you all who have bought from us over the last 13, going on 13 years. Thank you so much. Carol and I and the kids appreciate you. And thank you if you're new to Divine Fine Motors. Be kind to one another. Love on one another. And please read to those children and tell them how great they are. Bye-bye.